In this video, I'm going to show you how to stop TinyTask playback. Now this is actually very simple. So in case you recorded a macro, uh, let's say of some clicking, so I'm going to record one right now, and then you started playing it, however you mistakenly had this selected which says continuous playback, and then you weren't able to stop it, so you pressed play, and now you weren't able to stop it because you can't move the mouse while the operation is going on. The way you can stop it is actually quite simple. So before you do this, what you have to do is click on preferences and then go on to playback hotkey. And then you have to make sure you know what the playback hotkey is. So I'm going to tell you right now, if you haven't modified it, the default hotkey is Ctrl plus Shift plus Alt plus P. But that's kind of quite complicated, so I put it myself to F8 because it has no functionalities on my keyboard, keyboard uh, of my laptop on Windows 11. So yeah. Uh, I recommend F8 or maybe F12 if you don't have anything on there or maybe even print screen if you don't have a screenshot software. So of course you can always leave it as it is, just remember what this combination is. And then once you play it, so I have set a continuous playback as you can see, and if I start playing it, I'm going to press F8 right now, and as you can see, it stopped and I can move my mouse. If I press F8 again, it's going to start again and I can't use my mouse, as you can see, up there, there's that clock, and it says it's completed five times, now six. If I press F8, it's gonna stop, and it says the name of the file, and that's it. So, that's pretty much it, that's how you stop TinyTask playback. I hope this video helped you out, and if it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.